Um, okay, so we got another song coming up. Oh, this oh. is the I'm Good To Go song. I'm Good To Go. Or <laughs> whatever. <laughs> oh, sick of Space Camp. Oh, something is... This was one of the... Uh, I was about to, I'll, be, I'll be honest, I was about to call this song Saturday. <laughs> so, that shows you how much Wait, I am. Wait, it is Saturday. That was a song of Space No, it is. This is Saturday? Yeah, yeah. Whoops. If any song at um, some point represented Fall Out Boy in this era, uh, Saturday is definitely one of them. For a lot of different reasons, it's uh, it was it was one of those songs that I, because I you know I write so I this one I kind of wrote and I figured wasn't no one was gonna like it so I didn't even show it to the guys. It was one of these last minute. Hey, you got any other things? So I showed it to him. It was kind of just for me, and I uh, and uh, so the the chorus really the chorus this part and um, actually this whole section was was. Pretty much written without the without the word Saturday. That was kind of added later because I just I was just kind of mouthing words and that just sounded good. That that shows how much I know. Uh, I guess I'll be honest. That was a lucky guess. So I had this thing about graduating. So I was like, man, I'm gonna graduate and I'm a failure. I got nothing going for me. So that's kind of what the song's about for me on my end. And then I took it to Pete, and uh, and from there the song like we fleshed it out and. And it, it's really one of the first, like he said, it's one of the first uh, collaborations between us where we really, where it's really both of us going off, on, going off about it. So the verses, um, the verses are are the two of us sitting at Smart Studio on a couch, going like, "How about this?" I had, I had written originally was Pat and I, and for anybody who knows, uh, Patrick doesn't like to be called Pat, <laughs> and he can't sing Pat and I, so that's how it became Pete yeah. and I. And uh, made a joke about me slipping myself into the song. I remember talking with Patrick about like being the pop punk queen, with like in, in, in the aspect of the harmonies he did and stuff. That was. This is probably one of my favorite parts for Fall Out Boy in general. Just how it, it um, I think it just really came together very well. Like uh, as far as screaming, I think I have a heavier scream than a lot of people are kind of in. The genre of music we play so it was interesting trying to figure out how to work it in with Patrick's voice and have it not seem so much like uh, they were they were attacking each other and we kind of like went together um because at the same time I think Sean brought out some kind of warmth in the scream like where it's like kind of just, just like it's it like this sounds like one voice it's like another almost. yeah and it's like another instrument kind of it's like another layer rather than this really abrasive thing that's just kind of attacking you Yes, yes. I, can, I, can, I can see myself on the screen and I totally keep not looking at the camera. It's funny too, he'd never screamed before in the band. He was screaming in this really heavy band and we, we weren't even really going to have him scream, but just the part, we both, both of us were sitting there like, this part needs something. And I came up with that lyric, which is, by the way, is probably your favorite lyric I've ever written. So yeah, that's true. I, I won once. Um, and one of people, a lot of people's favorite parts of the song, uh, when Patrick does falsetto. I thought so. This was improvised, actually, the falsetto was improvised in practice one day, but anyway, yeah, the, the scream we came up with all on the spot, and it just, the song just fell, like, fell into place.